Hey, what's up guys? It's Nelson here with Gadrax, and today I'm going to show you how to vastly improve drag and drop on your Mac. The application that I'm going to be showing you guys is called File Pane. What it does is it improves drag and drop, allowing you to do more things than simply just dropping it. If you head over to their website, you can get a free download, which is a seven day trial, or you can purchase it for $4.99. Once it's installed, you can access it from your menu bar. If you click on it, you'll see this. Here you'll be able to disable it or activate whether you want to launch it at login. If you click on activate, you'll be able to see how many days you have left of the free trial and you can also purchase it here where it says buy license. So now let's use it and see what it can do. So let's say I wanna select all of these songs. All I have to do is now click and drag and you'll see this window that says drop here. I can drop them and then disappears. Here you'll see several options which will appear for most files. Uh, this first one is sharing it through email, so you'll share it through your mail app on the Mac. The second one turns all of those files into a zip file quickly. This one here allows you to create a folder in which you can place them, so if I click on that, I can enter a folder name, so I'll call it DG, done. And now it'll place all of those files in this folder. So now let's say I select an image. I'll just drop it here and I can convert the image so I can convert it to any of these options and I can also compress it. Uh, if I click on share, I'll be able to share the photo through Flickr, Weibo, AirDrop, Twitter and Facebook. If I click on something like Twitter, I'll receive something like this and you can easily post something up to your account. I can also set the photo as my desktop background. I can delete it and my personal favorite in which I can share the file to any destination on my computer. So if I click on this, here I can choose any of the set destinations or I can choose my own. So here's one that I've chosen. All I have to do is click on it and the file is transported instantly to that destination. And that's nice because that folder is deep within other folders. So here's screenshots, nothing bad, Jenny death, and then here is the file. So that's just an easy way to transport files and it saves a lot of time. And not only does this work with files that are on your computer, but also works with files that are in your web browser or in other apps. So let's say I want to drag and drop this picture. All I have to do is drag it and I can drop it here and I'll have options to set it as my desktop background, to share it through email, share it on social media, resize it, and also save it to my computer. All right, and that's it. You guys can experiment with file pane and see what it can do for you, but it's definitely made sharing files, uh, sending files, just simply managing files uh, way easier than before. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and check out the full tutorial over at Gadjax. All right, see you later.